Doppler effect occurs when sound waves from an approaching object are pressed against the listener, causing them to appear more frequently and raising the apparent pitch of the sound. As they move past the listener, the increasing distance spaces them further apart, causing the appearance of the pitch to gradually lower. A bit like this. In game audio, we want to replicate this phenomenon, and if we're using fmont, we can simply turn on the Doppler function. In this session, I have looped a sine wave and attached this to a moving object in Unity, and I've made sure that the event is specialized and that the Doppler macro is turned on. In Unity, the sound A object is emitting the sound, and the listener is in this case silent. In a car game, for example, the listener would have the sound of an engine, but to make the effect more apparent, I'm not added that in this case. In F mode, we can also increase the strength of the effect. So in the following game examples, we're switching between 100 and 500% on the inbuilt Doppler scale. We can also enhance the effect with a bit of wind noise. So like the sine wave, I've looped this in the session, but I'm also sending some of the noise pre-fader directly to the mixer, and this way bypassing the Doppler effect. This way we can use this as a lingering release effect as the object has passed the listener in the game. We can also use multiple objects and the effect will also follow any speed changes. But when working with multiple objects, we need to also pay attention to voices and other resources. So it's worthwhile turning on voice stealing and making sure that the instances are released. Instance count and voice stealing modes can be set in the event macros. And stopping the instance can, for example, be done with triggers and emitter settings or scripts. Making these changes can have a real effect on the resources we're using for the game, especially the number of voices we're using. So we can hear that the sound effect in the game isn't changing, but by managing the instances, we have a more optimized use of resources and a more effective game. Thanks for watching, and hopefully this was helpful, and happy game audio.